I hope you're having a wonderful day today. And I'm sorry if I sound a little bit under the weather. It's because I am. But I do anything in the world just to bring you good entertainment. Say hello to my little friends. Hi. <laughs> and today we're going to a cemetery that a lot of people didn't know was a cemetery because it's in a, a residential neighborhood. And you're welcome to come with us. Plus the fact that there's a little backstory behind it. And we'll tell you that once we find it. And it all starts now. Okay, the backstory is Hockley Cemetery, which was established 106 years ago by Jane Warren, our former slave, who later went on to own more than 100 acres on the northeast side were made hidden until a subdivision was built in 1980s and workers came upon the graves after that the cemetery again was forgotten it took a curious man to discover it all over again and bring in the archaeologist and, the, and it became a historical site so now they're working to fix it up um, and bless those guys' heart because those guys working and not really getting paid for it. They're volunteers. And it's funny because they said that they have volunteers working on it. I haven't seen any. They're the only volunteers we've seen so far. Just those four guys. Well, it was told that the lady, um, she passed away um, years ago. And I guess her descendants were scared to claim the land because they thought back then the taxes but were back taxes they were afraid to buy it because of you know to claim it because of back so, taxes so, so they let it go to the state the state took over and yeah so they bought out most of the acres and that was the only piece that was left that little one acre lot and it was just overgrown and turned into a fenced in brush area no one even knew was even a cemetery and so a curious father um, started doing research on it because he, you know, kept walking by it with his son and he wanted to know what it was and he found out that it was a cemetery. So they called in the historical archaeologist guy who came and did and pulled up, you know, a machine that finds graves. The sonar. That finds the graves and that came about. That's so sad. And hopefully we'll come up with more information. Um, and we're going to wait about a year and possibly try to go back there again and see the changes if there are any. Not bad. I was wondering, uh, by any chance, would this happen to be a cemetery? Yes, sir. Okay, we came to the right place. The cemetery, my man, was totally out of hand, as you can see. It, 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 you 
couldn't walk in here from the gate three weeks ago. Really? Yeah, so much. It just looked like a, a jungle that got out of hand. Vines and took the trees. We didn't clear it out. Now you can see a little bit. I am so glad you did. Well, you can see that all the stumps still in the ground from the trees we cut. Right. The trees was just growing everywhere. It's an old cemetery. How back? How far back would you? Uh, well, I, I read a brochure on it. Man, I got a brochure. The guy right there, he might got one in his car. You can let you read up on. Okay. From the 1800s, slaves. That's why I came. Slaves from the 1800s, 1802, 1825, 1817, way back in the 1800s. And there's no headstones. There's no headstone. That is so sad. You know, you, you know what? And it is sad. And not only this place. Just while working here and just listening at the news, is so many places all over the United States where black people then did great things. Mm -hmm. And they just put them and left them. They put them somewhere and left them. And literally, that's what happened right here. They put them right here and they left them. Wow. Yeah, I mean. <laughs> to believe that all this land that we're walking on is actually a cemetery. Ghost Dog, thank you Ghost Dog for these dowsing rods. Uh, huge shout out to him. Does anybody here like to talk? I want you to turn to my right if there's someone here. Turn to my right. Thank you. Okay, the straighten out. It goes back straight. Let's go back straight. Thank you. Do you mind us being here? Separate for yes, come together for no. They do mind. Okay, straight now. Straight now. Straight now. Thank you. Are you here by me? Come separate if you are, come together if you're not. It's right by me. Thank you. Okay, you straighten out. I appreciate you. Thank you very much. You know, I come here with a light of love. Nothing but respect. We brought you flowers out of respect because you were very disrespected in my book. So I'm going to ask you again, do you mind us being here? 
Separate for yes, come together for no. Thank you. Okay, straighten up. Straighten it up for me, please. I appreciate you. I really do appreciate you. Any member. What is your name? Yeah. Yeah, your name. What is your name? My name is Ed. Dee Dee. Did you catch that? Emmett. Emmett. Glad to meet you, Dee Dee and Emmett. This is my wife Jen and my son Cody. I'm sorry that they put you in a situation like this. Can you tell me what year you died? You know, these gentlemen are straightening this out for you to make it look real nice. Yes. We mean no disrespect, you know. We come here out of love. If you don't mind me asking, how did you die? Feel free to talk to me. Were you a slave? I hope you don't mind us being here. That's nice. I'm quite sure you were nice too in life. Okay, I'm gonna let you go, but I'm gonna come back. Thank you very much and God bless you. God bless you.
now we're going to try the portal just for a little bit uh, to see what we get on this. Again, uh, this time with the spirit box, or actually with the speaker. Is there anybody here that'd like to talk to us? My name is Ed, this is my wife Jen and my son Cody. Do you mind us being here? Yeah. Here. We come with uh, no disrespect, no ill wills. Are you at peace? Whispers. Where are you guys slaves? Were you treated right in life? We're gonna go ahead and let you go. We mean no disrespect. We came out of love. God bless you. We're going to go on ahead and go to the house and uh, call it a day, at least for right now, and let them work uh, in peace. Uh, we didn't mean to disturb them, but they actually let us go on ahead and do a spirit box session. Oh, so, God bless them, you know, but that's just really sad about the cemetery. and it, It's an actual cemetery with no headstones, and they're former slaves, and in a few...
a wrap. I hope you enjoyed today's video. I want to give a few shout outs if I may. I want to send a shout out to Jackie Wacky. Here's the name. And check out their YouTube channel. Their YouTube channel is really unique. If you love comedy and stuff like that, check them out. And subscribe and hit that like button to them. Tell them you see it on Eddie and Jen. I also want to send a shout out to Tim S., also known as Intense420. Here's his name. Thank you, Tim, for uh, not only uh, following us, but subscribing to us. And I forgot to mention you in the last uh, shout out, so I do appreciate you. God bless you. I want to send a shout out to Nikki Rocks. Here's her name. Thank you, Nikki. We love you. God bless you. And thank you for not only subscribing, but following me on Twitter. God bless you. We appreciate you. I send a shout out to Brenda Hall. Here's her name. Thank you, Brenda, for following us. Hopefully, you subscribe to us. Uh, send a shout out to Samella Hunter. Here's her name. Thank you, Samella, for uh, subscribing or following us. Hopefully, you subscribe to us. Uh, send a shout out to Angie the Fam. Here's her name. Thank you, Angie, for following us, and hopefully you subscribe to us. God bless you and your family. Uh, I want to send a shout out to Our Time. Here's the name. Make sure you check out their YouTube channel. This is a wonderful family. God bless them. Uh, they are truly wonderful. Make sure you get on there. Hit that like and subscribe button. You will grow to know these people. They are so, so nice. God bless you. And I want to send a shout out to Ray Amar R. I mean, I hope I'm saying that right. Well, before I butcher it anymore, here's the name. And I want to thank you very much for also following and subscribing. Hopefully you subscribed anyway. And final shout out to Curiosity Explorations. Here's the name. And thank you Curiosity Explorations for following us. I believe they have a website. So if you go on their website and check them out. And tell them you've seen them on Eddie and Jen. Now for my final view. I'm quite sure there's someone out there that you may have forgotten about. Or you haven't talked to in a long time. Why don't you give that person a call or drop them a line. Let them know that you're still thinking about them. Like that cemetery that we went to, those people were forgotten about. And we don't want you to forget about anyone. Just call and say hi, even if it's just hi. But to know that they're still alive and that you still care about them. It doesn't hurt to pick up the phone. Even if, it, if it's your enemies, love thy enemy. Sometimes the enemy is our own selves. So on that note, I want to thank you all for watching. And until next time, stay blessed.